Good morning. Happy Monday. All right. So hopefully everyone had is dried out from this uh, wet weekend. Um, nice to see the sun today. Today is weights and band day. So make sure you have your weights and a band or two close by. And with our there we go. Hang on here. We're going to start with arm circles all the way up and around for one, two, and three. And let's go the other way. One, two, and three. All right. And the other arm all the way up and around. And the other direction. One two, and three. All right. Let's put our shoulders back and down into their sockets, rib cage up off your hip bones. Stretch those arms out nice and wide, reaching for those opposite walls. I really want you to try to exaggerate your movements. Stretch, 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 stretch. All right. And we're going to come across for four, three, two, Swipe that wall in front of you and one and the other way. One, you're relaxing those shoulders down. Two, three, and four. And just squeeze those muscles in the back. One, two, three, four. And let's do six circles forward. Six, five, four, three, two, and one, and the other way. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And I just noticed I have one earring on. <laughs> All right, let's roll our shoulders around. Two, and three. I noticed I lost the back of one my earring yesterday, but it has a long stem, so I thought I'd be going to be okay. Hi, it's going to be in my bed. I know it. All right, <laughs> let's reach up to the sky. All right, all the way up, reach, 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 reach. And let's just reach over to one side, really reaching that arm up towards the sky and your belly is in. Feel the stretch coming all the way down your side. And then let's go to the other side. Nice, big, deep breath in and out. And to center and six full body squats. All right. So reaching for those walls, booty goes back. Nice big deep breath in coming up. Squeeze those glutes. Bellies into your back. Squeeze, last one. All the way up and bring those arms all the way down. All right. Three air squats backwards. Let's open up those hips. One, two, three, and forwards. One, two, and three, and the other way. Woo! And forwards. One, two, and three. All right, we're going to go all the way up onto our tippy toes. All right, down on one heel, up on your toe. Squeezing those calves. Squeeze. Squeeze. Last one. All the way up. Squeeze those calves and all the way down. And we're rolling. Rolling, rolling, rolling. And the other foot. And the other way. All right. Give a big old shake a room. Shake it up. Okay, so we have three exercises. 
We're going to do skipping for 30, squat, roundhouse, jab, 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 and going down on the mat for a snow angel. So your hands come around and you're gonna clap your hands, bringing your knees up and clap behind your knees. All right, so starting off with skipping. All right, let's do this. Nice little skip. Yeah, what a rainy, rainy, rainy day. I actually gulped yesterday in the rain. It was cold, but it was the uh, landings backwards. Um, groundskeeper's revenge. It was so much fun. What a riot. Two and one. All right, squat roundhouse. All right, so squat it down. Round, jab, 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 and then the other side. Okay, try to keep that rib cage up off your hip bones the whole time. Belly's in. And we're gonna have time for one squat and up. And we're down on the mat, all right? And bring those hands and just clap and drop those heels into the river. <sighs> Lifting your butt up off the mat. <sighs> and try to focus on your abs. Two, last one, and we're up for skipping. Oh, a little slow getting up that time. All right, let's do it. You can also pick it out if you like. Woo! Yeah, so the groundskeepers, they go out and they do funny things on the, uh, on the greens, put obstacles on there, skip it backwards, and uh, it was fun. And they had a great turnout, despite the weather. All right, squat roundhouse. Booty goes back. Keep that belly pulled in. Like in one of the greens, they had uh, about 80 golf balls all over the green. All right, going down, Snow Angel River Depths. Nice big deep breath out as your heels are coming down into the river. They have tractors and everything all over the place. They put, they tricked you. One flag was out on the green and then they had a little tiny flag and that was where the hole was. Come on up, we're skipping. So you were aiming for the big flag. And meanwhile, the hole was at the little tiny, tiny one. It was so much fun and backwards. Three, two, and one. Squat roundhouse. Booty back. Keep those shoulders back as well. Chest is open. Eight more seconds. One more to do. And down for snow angel dips. Woo! Oh. 
focus on those abs, belly to the back. Eight more seconds. And we're rock and roll and getting up. Skippity doo da. Woo! Skippity doo da. Skippity day. My oh my, it's nice to see the sun today. Skip it backwards. Eight, six, four, two, one. Squat roundhouse. Squat it down. Jab, jab, jab. Come on. Punch it. Duck it. Kick him. Punch him as he's going down. Let's do it. What? Last one. And snow angel dips, let's go. Last one. And up. Skipping. Woo. Woo. Come on. Woo. It's a chilly morning out there, though. And skip it backwards. I think it was one degree when I got out there. Time to plant garlic. Do that this week. Two and one squat roundhouse. We're not done. Let's go. Wah! Woo -hoo! Come on. Keep that rib cage up off your hip bones. Three, and we're done. Woo, that wasn't so bad. All right, grab a drink of water, shake it off. Woo. All right. You want to do our deadlifts, okay? Very important. So grab your appropriate weights. You can do deadlifts, bicep curl, deadlifts upright, or just plain deadlifts. All right. So standing, nice and tall, rib cage up, belly in, soft bend in the knees, graze down and snap it up. Keeping that belly pulled into your back. Shoulders are pushed back too. I'm gonna do two more. You guys do anywhere between eight and 15, depending on your weight. All right. I tweaked my back uh, on Saturday and uh, been heating it, feels great, so I'm good. All right, kettlebell swings, 20. So grab your weight that you wanna use. 
Roll those shoulders back, standing nice and tall. Feet pointed out that tiny little bit. Chest is open. All right, we're doing 20. Booty back. One, squeeze those glutes at the top. Three, four, keep that belly pulled in your back. Five, six, seven, squeeze those glutes at the top. Nine, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! All right, put those weights down. All right, we're gonna go down on the mats. We're gonna do chest press, fly to a try. All right, I'm gonna go really light just because my shoulders are still, I'm still working on them. All right, Ooh. but they still need to be strengthened. So that's why I'm still here. All right, so you're on your backs. You have two weights in your hand. All right, let's go up into high bridge. And we're gonna do press, so straight up. Turn those weights together, squeezing, and then a fly, two C's. Squeeze, and then bring those weights down to your forehead for the tricep. And then back for the press. Fly, squeezing, to try. Press. Push it up, fly to try. All right, on this time, I want you to really push your shoulders into the mat. Now we're gonna do fly, push those shoulders into the mat and try. Keep doing that. Press, fly. Coming up over top of your chest. Try. Keep going. Two more sets. Shoulders are pushed into the mat. Fly. Try. One more. Shoulders into the mat. Press. Ugh. Squeeze those mat, those weights together. Fly. And try. All right, nicely done. Did you notice the difference when you're pushing your shoulder into the mat? You're actually using the correct muscles, all right? Oh, okay, we're coming up to bicep 21s. All right, so grab your weight, shoulders are back into the sockets, rib cage up off your hip bones. We're going up and down for seven, six, Five, squeeze those weights. Four, three, two, and one. Bottom half. One, two, three, four, five, six. Extend those arms and seven. All right, all the way up and down for four, three, two, and one, all the way, we're at the top. We're going to do the top half. One, two, shoulders are relaxed. Three, four, five, six, and seven, all the way up and down for seven. This is the killer. Down, one, two, Three, four, lengthen, extend those elbows. Two, I think, and one, and release. And let's take those down, give those arms a shake, pulse of that back, roll shoulders. I had some light weights there. That's why I was able to do it. All right, good stuff. Okay, so back to the beginning. 30 seconds of skipping, 
30 seconds, squat, roundhouse, jab, jab, jab. We're doing this right now. Let's go, skipping. Keep going, that was just our bonus. <laughs> All right, skip it backwards. Woo -hoo! I think we have a couple of days of sunshine to get out there and finish off our gardening. Get the garlic planted, those bulbs planted. I planted 45 daffodil bulbs the other day in my little garden. Four, three, two, one. Squat, roundhouse, jab, jab, jab. Shoulders back, chest is open, booty back. Jab, jab, jab. Two and one, skipping, double dutch, let's go. Really fast, last 30 seconds. Come on, how fast can you go? This double dutch. Woo! And backwards. Come on, a little faster. 10, eight, Five, three, come on, and one. Squat roundhouse, last ones. Ten more seconds. Kick them, kick them, punch them on the way down. Watch. And we're done. Woo. All righty, grab a drink. Woo. Okay, we're doing reverse flies this time. So grab your weights, two weights, and you're standing, rib cage up, bellies in, shoulders back and down. All right, let's bend forward, weights come in front of your toes, and you're bringing those elbows straight back to squeeze all those muscles in the back. Two, three, Four, keep the belly pulled in. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. I'm doing twelve. You do your number. We'll wait for you. Awesome stuff. All right, we're back to um, 15 kettlebell swings. Let's do it. All right, so standing nice and tall. And booty goes back. One, two, belly in, three. Protect that back. Four, five, six, seven, ten, five, four, three. Squeeze those glutes. Two and one. All right, going down to the mat. Chest fly, chest press, fly, and try. Grab your weights. Oh, sorry, lots of moaning and groaning here. All right, all right, get up in there. Nice high bridge. 
All right. And we're going to push those shoulders into the mat. We're going to go up into a press. Shoulders are back. See, when you're pushing forward up there, your shoulders come up off the mat. I don't want them coming up off the mat. I want you to push those shoulders into the mat. All right. Fly, two C's, and try. And again, press. Fly. Try. Keep those shoulders into the mat. Almost forgot to try. Two more. One more. All right. Woo! Okay, we're gonna stay down here. We're gonna do Russian twists. So if you need, you need a, a weight, grab a weight, or just use the same weight that you have. All right, so let's put those shoulders back into their sockets, belly in, rib cage up off those hip bones. All right, come down that tiny little bit and Russian twist. If you want, you can keep your feet off the mat or down on the mat. We're doing 20. One, two, follow those with the weights. Three, four, five, six, belly in, seven, eight, nine, kind of looks forward, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Awesome stuff. All right, let's roll back down. Extend your arms. Extend your legs. Belly in. Reach for those opposite walls. Right arm, left leg. Left arm, right leg. And bring those arms all around and hug those knees. Roll side to side. And we're going to do three rock and rolls to our feet. One. Two. Keep the belly in. Three, up to red doll. Fold those arms. Stretch out those hammies and those glutes in the back. All right, arms are spaghetti. Soft bend in the knees, wiggle those arms. We work those shoulders. All right, pulse it up, find the lowest vertebrae, and roll all the way up. And roll those shoulders back. Whew, good stuff. All right, we're gonna grab your drink. We're gonna switch it over to power yoga. You will need um, some bands in hand. So grab those. <laughs> Not so bad, 902. Sometimes I think we're gonna be way over our, our time for, but we're never off by too much. Okay, standing at the end of your mat. Just gonna straighten my mats here. Okay, let's take those hands and go all the way up to the sky. And we're reaching, let's reach over to one side, nice stretch along the side and the other side, keeping the belly pulled into your back. 
and to center. And we're going down to ragdoll. So bring those arms all the way down those side up walls. All right, soft bend in the knees. We're gonna roll up again. Get the lowest vertebrae and then start to roll up, belly in. Coming up over top of those shoulder blades. Roll those shoulders back and lift that chin off your chest. Coming all the way up to the sky again and back down. Walk your hands out to downward dog. All right, we're gonna push away from those hands, get up there on those knuckle pads, chest being pushed to your knees. Just bring those hips a little bit to the side, just opening up your lats and the rib cage, upper rib cage. Still pushing your chest towards those knees. Let's raise that right leg up, three kicks. Bend that knee and look underneath your right shoulder. Reach that knee to that back wall. Straighten that leg out. And let's bring it all the way through to your right thumb. Two low lunge. All right, let's just drop our left knee, shoelace to the mat and bring our hands up to our knee here. And while you're doing that, grab your band and put it around your knuckles here. Cause we're gonna, soon we're gonna go up. Just let, just let gravity work. Nice opening up of the hips there. All right, so we're gonna go up into high lunge. All right, so get back up onto that toe to low lunge, hands out in front, power up to high lunge. Palms are together, I'm sorry, bands around your hands and we're gonna go up and down for six. Five, four, keep the belly pulled into your back. Three, two, and one. All right, turn that back foot and we're going to do bow and arrow. So your right hand is pointing up towards that upper crotch, elbow comes up and you're gonna pull it straight back for one. Shoulders are relaxed. Two, three, hold it back there for that second. Four, five, and six, and then we're gonna come back, roll your shoulders, come out straight from your shoulders, elbow is up towards your shoulders, and bring it back for six, five, four, three, two, and one. Nicely done. All right, turn, turn that foot so that we're in high lunge again. And we're gonna bring our arms all the way down to either side of your right foot. And we're going to bring that right foot back to your left foot, high plank. Shoulders are back into their sockets and we're plank twist to the right. And plank twist to the left to Chaturanga. I drop my knees. I'm going down for four, three, two, and one. And let's push our chest up. Squeeze those shoulders back. Have a nice little wiggle of those hips, relaxing them into the mat. All right, we're going to push, coming down to the mat, pushing up to high plank, to downward dog, push away from those hands, 
Bring that right foot high up behind you. Push your chest towards that knee that's there. And we're gonna bring that right leg all the way through to your right thumb. And we're going up to warrior one for five breaths. Keep the belly pulled into your back. Palms bring pulled in and breathe. On that last breath, bring that hand down to your right foot. Look up to your left hand. Lengthen those arms. Okay, we're going to bring that left arm down and around to your right hand, both hands out in front, power back up to a nice little back arch, to warrior one, bellies in, to cactus, bringing those elbows nice and slowly down to your side. Hands come to your chest. Do a couple little finger push-ups. Bring those hands back up to warrior one. And let's bring them all the way down to your side. Bring them to your back behind you and bring your chest down to your knee for humble warrior one. Clasp those hands behind you. Let's just raise those hands up to the sky a little bit for a nice little stretch. And we're going to bring those hands back down to your right foot. Out in front. And we're going to step forward with that left foot to your right foot into chair position. So both feet are together. Push that booty way back and let's swing our arms for six, five, four, three, two, and one. And come all the way up and bring it all the way back to the back side of your mat. We're gonna do the same thing for the other side, all right? So let's bring those hands all the way up to the sky. Reach, 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 reach. And coming all the way down to Ragdoll. All right, walk those hands out to Downward Dog. And push away from those hands. Biceps should be somewhere around your ears, chest being pushed to the to the knees, and your belly's being pulled up to the sky. Sway those hips side to side. And we're going to bring that right leg high behind you. Push your chest towards that knee and bring it all the way through to your right thumb. You're in low lunge. Let's drop that right knee, shoelace to the mat and grab your band. And let's just stretch out, just let gravity work. Place that band around your knuckles. Stretch is feeling pretty good right now. All right, toe to the mat. Okay, we're going to go back up to low lunge. Hands come in front. I want you to power up to high lunge. And we're going up and down for six. 
five, four, three, two, and one. Turn that back foot, left hand to that upper crotch. Roll those shoulders and squeeze them back and bring it back for one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, down. Shoulders, everything, shoulder height, just that shoulder height. Get that elbow up, bring it back for one, two. Remember to hold it back there for that second. Three, four, five, and six. Nicely done. You can drop that band. Turn your foot back up to high lunge, and we're coming all the way down to either side of that left foot, going into high plank. Push those shoulders back into their sockets. Plank twist to the right, opening up that chest, and plank twist to the left. Back down to high plank to Chaturanga, going down for four, three, two, and one. I just can't do it all the way down. All right, push your chest up, baby cobra. Relax those hips and squeeze those shoulder blades together, opening up that chest and breathe. All the way back down to the mat. Coming back up to high plank. To downward dog. Push away from those hands. Activate those shoulders. Ears are at biceps. Belly being pulled up to the sky. Nice big deep breath in and out. And we're going to take that left leg up high behind you. All the way through to your left thumb. Turn that back foot. We're going to go up to warrior one. And breathe for five. And let's bring that left hand down to your left foot, right hand all the way up. Look at those fingers up there. Let's bring that hand all the way back down and around, coming to your left hand, reach forward, power up to warrior one, back little back arch, to warrior one, to cactus, nice and slowly, leading with those elbows, feeling all those muscles go in the back, coming all the way down to your side, hands come to chest. Bring your hands back up to the sky and we're going to bring them down in front and back behind us to humble boy, warrior one. Hands come back behind, chest comes down, entwine those hands and bring those arms up a little bit for a nice stretch of those shoulders. Make a 
flat down. We're gonna bring those hands down and in front. And we're gonna step our right foot to our left foot, come up into chair. Booty goes back, tap your toes and let's swing those arms for six, five, four, three, two, and one. And come all the way up and roll those shoulders back. And we're gonna come right back down into the mat, into tabletop. Have your hands underneath your shoulders, knees underneath your hips. And we're gonna have three clicks of the heel. Make a wish for today. Awesome. We're just gonna do a little cat and cow here. And we're gonna do it the fascial way. So you're gonna push your hands into the mat, resist bringing them towards your knees and then start going up into cow, looking up, keeping that resistance and release. Into the mat and push away from those knees as you're going up into cat, chin to chest, Really bring that belly up to the sky. Have a nice little wiggle. And release. One more cow. Push in and resist bringing to your knees, going up to cow. And release. And to cat. Into the mat, resist. Pushing away, coming all the way up to cat, chin to chest. And release. All right, let's extend our right leg out to the side. We're gonna do rainbow taps from here. So let's take that right foot out to three o'clock. Watch it with your eyes, bring it all the way back and bring it to the other side of the mat, taking a look at it. All right, so that's one, keeping the belly pulled to your back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, leave it out at three o'clock. Put that flat foot flat on the floor. So the outer edge of your foot is flat on the floor. And we're just going to slowly with a nice big deep breath out, sit down on that left leg. We're coming all the way down to the mat, bringing your forehead down to the mat and keeping that outer foot flat on the floor. And then come back up and bring that leg in. And let's do the same thing to the other side. So rainbow, three o'clock, come across and take a look with your eyes. One, two, three, four, belly to your back, five, Six, seven, and eight. And then left foot out directly from your hip, flat out, and slowly just start sitting down onto that mat. Extend those arms. And then come back up, bring that leg in. And from here, you're gonna grab a band or no band, it's totally up to you. We're gonna do our clams. So if you're doing it with a band, let's place that band above your knees. 
right? Just above your knees and we're gonna lie down on our sides. We don't have to do it with a band at all. You can just do it. The other last week I did it with no band and it was, it's still a huge workout. All right, so 20 clams. So I want you to lift that waistline up off the mat and your feet and we're going up and down for 20. Three, four, five, six, seven. Hold it up there for that second. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Right leg comes down, extend that left, toe pointing down, and we're gonna go up for eight. Hold it up there for that second. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come out to the middle center, right up directly out from your hip, and six circles. Two, three, four, five, and six. The other way. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it all the way back. Both feet together off the mat and up and down for one. Two, three, four, five, and six, and six, walk the dog. One, hold it out there, belly into your back. Two, three, four, five, and six. And coming up onto your elbow and your knee for six crunches. Elbow to knee. One. Extend. Two. Really bring that belly into your back. Three. Four. Five. And six. Woo! All right. Let's switch over to the other side. All the way down. All right. Get the waistband up off the mat. Feet come up. And we're doing 20. Remember, it's a glute, not the front, not your hip flexor. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, feeling the glute, 17, 18, 19, and 20. All right, straighten that top leg. Still waistline up off that mat, toe pointing down, up, hold it, one, two, have that leg nice and heavy, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, out front, directly from your hips, six circles, this is the killer, one, two, Three, four, five, six, the other way. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Oh my gosh, thank goodness. Feet come together, belly in, up and down. We're getting those muffin, muffin tops. Two, you should feel a nice little muscle tug right there three four 
five and six and walk the dog. Belly in, one, two, three, four, five, and six, and then up for our crunches. All right, lengthen and crunch. Elbow to the inside of that knee. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And coming all the way back down, let's sit up right and let's take that band off. Nicely done. All right, let's sit a little bit cross-legged here. Sitting tall. Oh, oh, oh. Put a little pressure on those knees. Feel those glutes are working there. And let's switch feet the other way. And let's take your left hand, place it over to your right knee. And let's look behind for a nice deep breath in and out. All the way across to the other side. In. And let's take our soles of our feet now, pull them in, open up those knees. Let's take those legs all the way out. Let's bring our hands all the way up to the sky for a nice forward fold. We're going to walk those hands down the ceiling to the upper crotch, down the wall. Reach for that wall in front of you. Your eyes are now looking down at your legs. Reach, 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 reach. And then just collapse down wherever you may be. Nice big deep breath in and out. Another nice big deep breath in and out. Back up, sitting nice and tall, roll those shoulders back. Let's take our hands back behind us and let's just do a couple knee taps here, pushing your hip flexor forward and switch. Turn likewise on your mat for three rock and rolls to ragdoll. One. Two. And three. Up to ragdoll. Soft bend in the knees. Wiggle. And we're just going to roll all the way up. Roll those shoulders back. And let's just open up those arms. Couple pulses backwards. And then we're gonna dive into the water and bring those arms all the way back and roll. And let's take your right arm, walk it back behind and walk down your back. And switch sides. Hands come up to cactus. Let's bring those hands over right, elbow over left. Open them back up. 
Bring them in, left elbow over top. Open them up and bring them down. And let's have a little shake a room, shake it up. That's it for today. Woo. Monday, high fives. Good stuff. That was great. Felt good. good.